Yo, what is up, guys? This is Randy, and we're back with another. Holy sh! <gasps> I look tired. I just woke up. Let me go wash my face real quick. All right, we're back. Um, I washed my face. I threw on a hoodie because my hair was messed up. But today we're gonna be talking about. 2K19. Now, I'm going to be telling you guys like what I want to be in the game, like my wish list and stuff like that because they haven't really released any news about Park. They just been talking about more gameplay stuff, but there's a lot that I want this year. I want mascots to return first of all. I was talking to someone that works for 2K. I don't know if I could say what they said, so I'm going to stay quiet, but I want mascots to return and I hope the gameplay system isn't as bad as this year because this year it was pretty bad. I didn't really like it too much. Now, they were talking about some gameplay stuff. Like, Mike Wang was tweeting about some gameplay stuff, but I wasn't really following it at the time because I was still posting Fortnite and stuff, but I'm done with Fortnite now. I'm completely done with the game. The game is not fun to me at all. Even Playground. I was playing Playground once. And it was kind of boring, so that's not fun to me at all. So we're done with Fortnite completely. But, yeah, Mike Wang was talking about some gameplay stuff. I didn't really look in depth what it was about, but the way he was talking about the dribbling system this year, it sounds different. It sounds like it's going to be really good this year. And they need to make this game good because I have high expectations for the game. And I, I really want it to be a good game because they, there's no way they can make two bad games two years in a row. So they got to make this game good. And I, I really hope they do. But first off, we want I want mascots back in the game. And then second off, I hope there's a rep. I hope there's another rep system. I don't want it to be like overall is your rep. They should make overalls a completely different thing. And then they should add a rep system because the rep system was really fun. And, you know, you felt good whenever you repped up because it's easier to I feel like it was easier to rep up to get your overall up. But still, I feel like repping up just feels better. I don't know why. It just gives me a better vibe than overall because rep does not really change your skill. I mean, it gives you some stuff like park specific dunks, park specific dribbles. And another thing, the park specific dribbles. I heard some cool things about it. I heard it's going to be like street ball kind of. That would be really fun, you know, if you could like throw the ball behind your defender's back and then catch it on the other side and stuff like that. So I hope that's good. That's going to be pretty cool. And I'm sorry if this video is like all over the place because I, I did not make a script. I did not make a list of what I want to be in the game. I, I'm literally talking off the top of my head. So sorry if this video is all over the place. But the next thing I want is affiliations back I, I i feel like they're not gonna put it back but i wanted to come back because it was so much easier to travel to another park instead of go to the whole neighborhood where there's only six courts and it's so laggy like if there were affiliations it would be so much easier because old town would have their own parks sunset would have their own parks and then rivet would have their own parks and that's honestly way easier than what they have this year because this year, I didn't really like it. You know, the park was stale. They got another thing. They got to make the parks more colorful. Like this year on the threes courts, it's gray. Like it's all gray. And the even the chain nets. I don't like the chain nets. I don't know why, but the chain nets really bother me. Like I last year in 2K17, I did not enjoy playing at Rivet specifically because of the chain nets. I don't know if it's just me or let me know in the comment section do the chain nets bother you guys like just the noise of them it's like i don't know it just bothers me but yeah they got to bring affiliations back and they got to make the parks more colorful even like on the twos they did fine you know the floor is different colors it looks cool but i don't know i just feel like the threes it's kind of gray and the mood is kind of like dull and i feel like if it looks like that it just makes me not want to play. I don't know why. Like, I've actually been having a good amount of fun on 2K18 recently. But I've been having way more fun on 2s than 3s. 3s have kind of been boring to me, but 2s have been really fun. I don't know if it's because of the color of the courts or what. But you guys let me know if that's, like, relevant or not. Because I don't know if... I don't know if the color scheme like changes anything but it just makes me feel different like if there if it was more colorful you know if it feels like sunset beach in 2k17 where there's lights everywhere i just feel like i don't know i just feel like that changes everything let me know if that's just me or do you guys feel the same way but another thing is jetpacks like 
the 99 overall reward what even was it it was just like to be on 2k tv or something it was nothing crazy but i like the jetpack concept i like the whole jetpack thing and then even the legend reward for last year was bad it was just like a basketball or something but yeah they gotta bring back the uh the jetpacks that was actually pretty cool i played on a superstar 5 account i never owned a superstar 5 account but one of my friends let me play on their superstar 5 account and it felt so weird to fly that jetpack around so they gotta bring jetpacks back it was pretty cool same with mascots i really really hope they bring mascots back because there was never a year where I actually got the high enough rep to become a mascot. I was a superstar 2 in 17, but then I reset my rep like an idiot. But they need to bring back mascots because I never got to be a mascot and I really, really want to be a mascot. If they bring them back this year, I will definitely grind to be one. But I don't know how I feel about this game. I'm like excited for it. But at the same time, if it's going to be bad, I won't be surprised. But I'm pretty excited for it. I hope I, I hope it's going to be a good game. I really have some high expectations for it. And lastly, we're going to be talking about my goals. Now, I know we didn't talk about too many things on my wish list, but I was making this video off the top of my head once again. But we're going to be talking about my goals now. So I'm at 7,531 subs when I make this video. So today, July 27th at 1.58 p.m., I'm currently at 5,731 subscribers. Now, I'm really close to 10K. I know I'm going to hit 10K the month 2K comes out or the month after because I'm going to be posting every day. I have, a, I have a week off from school, like the week after 2K comes out, and I'm staying home for that break. So I'm going to upload every day, stream every day. But my main goals for 2K19 are... I gotta hit 10,000 subscribers first. 10,000 is where I'm aiming for right now, but my goals for 2K19 are 100,000 subscribers. Honestly, just 100,000 subscribers. That's where I'm looking at right now. I know my views have been going up, which I appreciate. Thank you guys for that. My, my first 2K video back got like 400 something views, so that's pretty crazy. Thank you guys so much for that, but all I'm really aiming for in 2K19 is 100,000 subscribers. Oh yeah, and... 100,000 subscribers and be invited to 2k20 community day i know that's going to be hard because this year they didn't really invite anybody 2k related except for like the ogs like jesser kuda but like jesser kuda lsk those people but i i hope they start inviting 2k youtubers like that came up this year or last year because if that's the case, then I, I know I could go in 2K20 because I, I know I can hit 100K this year. I'm friends with pretty much every big 2K YouTuber you guys could name. So I have like I have them to go to for advice and things like that. And a lot of them have told me that I can easily hit 100K this year. And coming from people that already have done it, telling me that I could do it, I know I can. Because you know you guys know there's always a new wave of YouTubers who like blow up every 2K. And I was talking to Davis and he told me that in 2K17, you know, he, he had like 40 subs and now he's at 200K. So if he could do that, anything's possible because he literally started from the bottom in 2K17 and finished off with like a hundred something K. So if he did that, I could definitely do that. If he started from less than a hundred subs, I could do the same thing because with Fortnite, every time I looked up a challenge that I thought of, I could never do it because someone already did it, but 2K, I'm actually original. Like I started the Siri picks my whatever thing and a bunch of people, I'm not going to say names, but people kind of stole that idea from me, but no hate to anybody. But um, yeah, my goals are to hit 100K this year to get invited to community day for 2K20 and just to have fun with it and grind. I really hope this game's a good game. I know it'll be a good game. But yeah, that's all I got to say for this video. If you guys are new, hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. I'm going to be dropping a challenge video tomorrow. I'm sorry I've been lacking with all the content. I've just been chilling and relaxing. I'm not going to make any excuses. I, I've just been chilling playing video games. I've been playing a lot of PUBG. That game's pretty fun. But once 2K19 comes out, I'm going full grind mode. We're going daily uploads or streams. I'm going to be uploading every single day bunch of good content we're gonna be doing a bunch of challenge videos things like that so if you guys are new be sure to hit that like button subscribe and turn on post notifications and let's get this video say 70 likes let's get 70 likes on this video yeah that's all i gotta say 
be on the lookout for some good content. I'm about to be dropping some bangers on bangers on bangers. Once 2K19 comes out, bangers are coming your... <coughs> Once 2K19 comes out, bangers are going to be coming your way. So stay tuned for that. And yeah, till next time, it's Randy and I'm out. Peace. Blame on me, no shame on you. No, you can't hide the truth. I'ma slide right through your roof. My pop a pillar too. Let them hate, we chop the deuce. That we get loose. Be sweeter than some juice. I slurp it like a snake. She a naughty type on the weekend. Perfect night, she gon' let me start the creep.